Thank you. Um, all right, sometimes all you need to do is sit down and write out how you feel. We could use that right now. <laughs> it's a therapeutic method used a lot in this particular classroom. Devin Mishuli takes us to Manual High. In Adrian Tinsley's creative writing class, high school students become authors. Students are um, creating different uh, short little uh, books, uh, fiction, nonfiction, drama, and poetry, and it's going really well so far. Storytelling, journaling, and other forms of creative writing are safe outlets for these students to get their thoughts, ideas, and feelings out into the world. It's important because kids are able to express themselves in a different way, and they're able to say, this is how I feel, this is what is important to me. While Miss Tinsley is also an English teacher, she's the first creative writing teacher at Manual. It's been an amazing experience. The class I have is fantastic, and I've been real, I'm really honored to be the first creative writing teacher here. She's also only been teaching for two and a half years, but she already has big goals. I'm going to, at the end of the year, have each student's uh, work bound into books and then give that to them at the end of the year. So each student will officially have their own authored book. Creating books isn't cheap, so we stopped by to help. Congratulations, you won $1,000. And once they receive their new books, I hope that it will fill them with a sense of pride, like this is what I accomplished out of the entire year, and they can take that home and say, hey, look, this is what I did. She hopes that writing can remind them that their thoughts, ideas, and feelings matter. The mark I hope to leave is that they have a voice, and their voice should be heard in whatever uh, form that comes out of but I hope it comes out in, in a creative way. Now, typically writing classes are quiet, but we ask them to get loud to celebrate their teacher. Thank you, 25 News and Seth Q. Congrats to them.